<laughs> Any company stranger. I've got all the company on me. Oh, Kurt. And this is my brother, Kyrgyz. Kurt is very mysterious. No one knows why he's there in the first place. He is sneaking into a place that is technically under siege, so you must be the enemy or you must be doing something sneaky. So he's after doing a bit of study about what's going on in the town. It's a bit of an embarrassment because the garrison has been overrun by this, these gangs and the Dutch are pretty much locked out of their own garrison. Sounds like a bird from hell! He's a wild card. He just brings a whole crazy new element to the system. Coming into episode four is Wei's whole story, whole backstory. Zheng Wei is basically the right hand man of Qi. Nothing goes down without you asking me. So a little bit of, of their relationship is revealed. Wei and Ryuichi has a special connection. We both have some kind of pain. I was found in the gutter, dying. We both lost something in our past. You've never had children. Have you, Major General? You will never experience the grief I am going through. Ben Klein's a man born to rule, a man of privilege. My son is starving and tortured like an animal. Lord Ben Klein ultimately sees DeWitt as a drunk, failed general, you know? You see new arrivals coming into the town, and that sort of adds a whole new dynamic. It's full of surprises. No better than to insult those less fortunate than you, eh? But you'll soon find out how hard it is to do with a hole in your head. With the idea of Kurt Stay, because he was so visual, you know, a kind of oddball assassin, not knowing whether he's playing for the left or the right. <laughs> His character is nuts, basically, and he has these conversations with his brother as if he's still alive. To him, he is still alive. A few days in here, give us the rest we need, eh? Who are you talking to? He carries his brother's head around to remind him of the fact that he is out for revenge. He's a wild card. He's unpredictable. You can take what is mine when I'm dead. At the beginning of the story, I am opium addict. I lost my Bushido spirit. Wei and Ryuichi has a special connection. We both have some kind of pain. Broken souls find themselves to Chi. It's not just her life that she's protecting. I can't be the only shepherd looking after my flock. Ben Klein's a man born to rule, a man of privilege. My son is starving and tortured like an animal. See Van Klein, so you get to understand a little bit why Dan's like he is a bit. Do you know who you're dealing with? The witch just snaps. Dispatches him very quickly. <laughs> So you have all these new arrivals coming into the town, and that sort of adds a whole new dynamic. Such an honor. Don't need to worry like you, Kalia. Kalia is the type of person that can read people like a book, so it is easy for her to see who Adnan really is. There is obviously a power shift. That shift has sort of swung against her a little bit, so she has to really prove herself much harder than she ever had to before. 